Hey guys, welcome to my brand new Let's Play of Banjo Tooie, a game that I have been just meaning to play on this channel for quite a while now, and today is finally the day we're gonna be beginning it. And whoever is tuning this banjo needs to do a better job. There we go. <laughs> oh man. I, can I just be the first to say, I love this game. I love almost every Rareware game, but gosh, this one just... I don't know exactly what it is, but it has always stuck with me as an amazing game, and yeah. See Klungo, he's still trying to push that rock, dude. You, just give up, it's too big, man. <laughs> oh, man. I just, I don't know how, even how to put it into words, but this game, I just love it. It's... Magical innocent. No, not really, but well, let's shut up, John. Let's start the game and yeah. We get to choose. Who do you think I'm gonna pick? I'm gonna pick Banjo Safe. What do you think? I'm stupid? I'm not gonna pick Mombo for crying out loud and yeah. This game has sort of a bit of a lengthy opening cinematic. It's not too bad though. The first game had an opening too in the same vein, but it wasn't necessarily as long, but yeah. Two years have passed since Gratel the Witch was defeated by Banjo and Kazooie. Wow, that is the most annoying narrator voice I could have ever conjured at my mind. Holy crap. Let's just, just never do that again. And after falling from the tower, she was buried underground, where she remains until this very day. Dots. Yeah. Klungo, come on, dude. Give up. You, you gotta eat something, man. You've been out here for like a year straight. Gosh. <laughs> Look at his little feet, dude. He's giving him his tracks, and I assume. And no good. Mistress still can't shift rock. Uh. Oh, Klungo, man. Mm. Mm. Oh, because of that stupid bit. Hey, man, Kazooie helped too, you know. Just saying, and. Yeah, it's a dark and stormy night where the heroes from the last game were playing cards, apparently, and mumble play where? As much a best guy. <laughs> it's kind of funny to see him, you know, just hanging out, and he's right, Kazooie. There goes your bird seed one. <laughs> Don't be so sure, Banjo. Uh, I guess Kazooie's got a plan. Hey, look outside, everyone. Grunty the Witch is coming. Wait, what? Really? Oh, that's messed up, dude. <laughs> Where, Kazooie? I can't see her. Oh, uh, false alarm bottles. Must have been some shit. <laughs> Let's take advantage of bottles, man. You can't see. He's a mole for crying out loud. And come on, bone face. I feel lucky. All right. Hopefully get a better hand than a pair of twos this time. And Oh, no. A cinematic pan to the other side of the mountain face. Oh, no. And the music changes to something more sinister. And, and there's a bunch of rocks that are totally not going to move. Holy crap, I just jinxed myself. <gasps> Another one moved! No! It's a giant metal pencil with a gas problem! No, it's j actually a giant drill. I at least remember that one. <laughs> and... Stop rocking the table! You're making me... <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, now that's sick, and Mumbo not rock table, old house, cheers, lots! <laughs> and he sounds like DK, right? <laughs> exactly, pretty sure the same sound file, and perhaps one of us should go take a look outside. Ooh, I can't do it, because <laughs> you know, I'm the main character and all. And oh man, it's, what's happening? I'm going to totally act like I don't know because i played this game before and I completely know exactly what's happening. Wow, it's a... Giant drill. Oh man. With a very weird uh, arc in its drilling. You think you think that part could move, because you don't always need to dig straight up. Hmm. Why exactly am I questioning the composition of a mechanical device in a fictional video game? Uh no one knows. It's probably just gonna stupid and crap, I need to think of voices for these characters. Probably should prepare a little bit more, huh? Hmm. Hey, blah blah blah. I said it is what's happening. Um. All right, blah blah. I don't even remember what she looks like. Uh, that pretty much fits the, uh, the name, I guess. <laughs> Quickly, we must go. What angry Guanty will be? Uh, then get off me. You missed. I move. I cannot. Gosh, I just I hate Yoda's. It makes me just sound extra stupid. And Gosh, it's stopped now. I wonder what it was. 
Mm, sure was noisy. Let's go take a look, Kazoo. Mm, but, but, but it's dark out there. And I'll be scared. Uh, something tells me you're not scared. You're just lazy, but. Hey, what do I know? Mamo, much brave. Me go look outside. Back in minute. All right. <laughs> Gives himself like a fist pump and say, like, hey, come back to my cards, dude. Ah, uh, what a sucker. <laughs> Banjo, give me a hand. <laughs> what? Oh my gosh. Kazooie? Does Kazooie's cheating know any bounds? Apparently not, and. Metal Skull. There's a joke there. I don't. I messed it up. I don't care. Moving on. <laughs> so we messed with. I failed you. Well, a Gwenty Muffet gets you out of your system. Big walkers. So powers must combine. Gosh, I just shut up. Why do you talk like that? Gwenty sister, you shall not mock. Now watch our magic blast this rock. So you have specifically a spell just for destroying larger than normal boulders. Huh. That's, that's an interesting spell book you have there. And Clone goes just like, well, this kind of val invalidates my entire year of existence now, doesn't it? Oh man, that's kind of sad when you think of it. <laughs> a nice camera shot there. God walk has become. Bleh. Oh man, here she comes. The revenge of Grunt. Actually, that's a totally different game. But you know what I mean. And Clone goes like, yeah, guys, we did it. Oh man, she's back. No, no, this cannot be. What's happened to little old me? Uh, nice Grunty looks lost weight you have. Uh, I hate bones. A body I need. Can you help me with this little di- Wow, that's hilarious. <laughs> yes, find the help we have. So go back to a castle, we must go. Uh, right then. Girls, let's fix me up. Then Banjo's Harry butt I'll whop. Oh man, I missed you, Grunty. Grunty, I've said it once, I'll say it again. Grunty is the best antagonist ever. And that's not good. Me go to Banjo. He's like, yeah, I'm gonna save the day. Um, Moonbone. Ah, thin earth bony may have, him we must work. Leave it to me. He's no hassle. I'll kick butt, then off to the castle. <laughs> oh god, Grunty's back and with a vengeance and. Uh, has an interesting walk cycle and likes to spam the same attack, it would seem, over and over again. And oh man, Mumbo, you gotta run, dude! Ah! Guess I'll be having that bird seed after all. Huh, <laughs> Banjo? And back of the house. But you cheated, Kazooie! That's not fair! <laughs> See, that's kind of a weird hand motion there, and everyone <laughs> must run! <laughs> Quick, Grunty, coming! Wait, are you serious, Mumbo? Or are you just trying to cheat at cards? <laughs> Revenge is mine! I cannot miss! Let's see that fairy fool dodge this! Oh gosh, she's summoning the biggest, most deadly attack! The one she tried to use last time, and... Yeah, yeah, Skull Boy. And I bet she had two heads! <laughs> well, she stays a little bit, not two heads, though. No joke! Look! They're coming! Oh god. He's serious! Oh, he's run! Quick, everyone, out! Oh god, no! Everyone, run! I'm not falling for that trick again. I'm staying right here. Bottles. No. Bottles! I hope he's okay. God. Hey, you must. Ready to leave, we are. I, I, I gotta say, Grunty's sister's not really as funny as her. And hold on, sis! I'm nearly there. I've just been to blast that bear! <laughs> As she waddles into her tank machine and tooth, we will leave the store area. They will. So you're just gonna launch. How do these people even gather pterodactyls? And how are these troops? Are they trained in milit? <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> I just realized it's odd. It's like, all right, let's send out our dinosaurs to destroy this area. And Stop! We for me, Mistress Quanti. No, no, Klungo. You stay here. I'll be back. Have no fear. <laughs> Why well, can't you take Klungo, man? What? Is there maximum occupancy three? No, because I had all the troops. Okay, why am I questioning this cutscene still? I don't really know, and... Oh, man. Last night was crazy. Not, not in a good way, though. Yeah. 
kind of kind of got our house destroyed <laughs> at the beginning of the game, and that's not all. Uh, where's bottles? Mumbo's skull hurts. It, it, it said head, but you, you know they meant skull. And well, at least everyone got out safely. D did they though, Banjo? I think we're missing somebody. Hang on. Where's Goggle Boy? Uh, good question. Oh. Y you okay, Bottles? Y you don't look so hot, man. Oh god. Oh no! More looks unwell. You, you can say that again. He's burnt to a crisp, Mumbo. It's worse than that. Roger's killed poor Bottles. <laughs> I forgot this happened. <laughs> he wasn't the favorite character in Banjo Kazooie, anyway. <laughs> Kazooie, that's horrible. <laughs> that's so messed up, man. The guy dies, and it's like, eh, no one liked him, anyways. Gunty wreck house and kill bottles. She must pay. Bear and bird, go after witch. Mumbo, see you later. Oh man, a quest for revenge. Great. I gotta peck some more witch. And you're excited about pecking butts, Kazooie. <laughs> I have a feeling it's not gonna be so easy this time. Hmm. So our quest for revenge begins <laughs> as Bottles is killed within the first 10 minutes of the game. Yeah, all I remember is being a little kid and almost crying that one of my favorite characters died and oh no, various insects are taking an interest in my corpse. Oh my god. Don't worry, Bottles, we're gonna get your Actually, you're probably not going to get your body back, but we'll get revenge. And yes, this game starts off in the coolest way possible. Unlike a lot of games, you have access to every single skill that you have, and Klungo's still watching that hole in the wall. This stupid bear and bird coming. Me wait for them in here. All right. Cool. Uh, anyways, as I was saying, yes, you can retain all of your skills since we last ventured inside of Grunty's lair. Which includes the Talon Trot, the ability to fly, shoot eggs, pretty much everything. And can I just say, I wish more games did that. I mean, all of the sequels coming out, there's no reason we can't just, you know, get the same powers from the previous game. That's just the way I see it. it was a really unique idea. And you know, all the mole holes are still here in case you don't remember how to use the abilities and such. But yes, there is a brand new adventure waiting for us right beyond this hole. In the next episode of Let's Play Banjo Tooie, we enter the Isle of Hags. So see you guys then. <laughs>